briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1973, Daryl Rougeau, a former employee of Firestone Tire and Rubber Company, sued his former employer for defamation and false imprisonment over the company's investigation into missing property. Rougeau claimed that during the investigation, led by corporate security manager E.E. E. Drummond, he was coerced into confessing and portrayed as a liar and thief, resulting in his termination. Despite these accusations, the trial judge found no evidence of wrongdoing on Drummond's part and determined that the investigation was conducted in an orderly manner. As a result, the judge ruled in favor of Firestone, dismissing Rougeau's claims. The case was appealed to the Louisiana Court of Appeals, which upheld the original decision, finding that Rougeau had failed to prove the necessary elements of defamation and false imprisonment. The court affirmed the trial judge's findings and determined that Firestone had conducted a reasonable investigation into the suspected theft. Furthermore, the court discovered no evidence of publications or notoriety surrounding the investigation. Ultimately, the court decided against Rougeau and ordered him to pay the costs of the appeal. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.